What is up my crazy subscriber? This is Joe King John City 4 and today I'll be talking about some of the patch notes that happened over the past few days. If you guys are not aware yet, there was a lot of nerfs happening over the past few days and I think most of these are controversial to be honest because some of these guns I mostly use like the Core 45, the Bass B, there's the MTZ also, there was a DMR. So I'm like really shocked about these type of changes because uh, most of these guns are much needed. You know, there's a lot of things in this game that are really really questionable like the time to kill uh which is why i don't use the smgs because they just tickle my enemies they don't do damage at all this is the first this is like, actually like the second cod where i had to switch out from smgs to assault rifles or battle rifles because the smgs do not do enough damage and they just i have to waste like like two-thirds of a mag to kill someone which is ridiculous i increase the range to the maximum and they still don't make enough damage most of the smgs in the modern warfare 3 game need to be buffed but I'm surprised they even nerfed the Fennec. What the hell was using the Fennec, man? I swear. So, um, anyways. So, yeah. Um, I do have my opinion about this list. And I play mostly multiplayer. I know people are going to be saying, like, well, it's all about Warzone, blah, blah, blah. I mean, I don't care. Really, I do not care. You all have your own opinions. I have mine. And my opinion is, you know, I've been enjoying myself in 12v12 multiplayer. And it's been very fun. Every single COD since Call of Duty Black Ops 1. Um, I've been playing Ground War. I like the 9 versus 9 modes. I like the 12 versus 12. You know, Ground War, the original Ground War style is what I used to play back in the day, and I still do to this day. And um, most of these guns that they listed, like the Core 45, which is the best pistol in the game, got nerfed by a lot. I'm like, dude, what the fuck, you know? <laughs> so now when it comes down to close range combat, I have really had to like probably insert like three to four extra bullets to kill someone. Um, another controversial one that I see is the Bass B. Now, most of the assault rifles are quite decent, not the best, but um, I know some of the accuracy makes up for most of the damage on most of these guns, but the Bass B was pretty much not accurate, but very strong. So it kind of did like a counterpart thing, you know, where you have to be strong in one thing or the other, and of course, they it has more damage than accuracy. But uh, to see it nerfed, I'm like, oh my god. And a lot of people complain about it because of Warzone, which is, I get it. I mean, I guess y'all don't really want to make damage whatsoever. You guys really want to survive that much. But um, but man, I mean, it kind of sucks because most of these guns just tickle the enemies, which is why I don't even use the SMGs to begin with. And I'm surprised I even saw the Fennec in there. I'm like, what the fuck? <laughs> Since when? <laughs> Since when? Who the fuck uses the Fennec in this game, bro? That, that gun kind of sucks to this day. It wasn't even that good. Maybe it was good in some kind of ex like uh, exposed way. Like some maybe somebody figured out something that would kill enemies quickly, which is understandable. I mean, I would love to know that class. But now that it got nerfed to Oblivion, I'm like, nah. So, um, that's interesting to see, but <laughs> whoever figured that out, I mean, congratulations to you, because I'm usually like an SMG guy uh, in every single Call of Duty, but this will be the second COD that I actually just use assault rifles to a battle rifles or single shot weapons, because most of the SMGs suck in this game, that have to result down to Modern Warfare 2 SMGs. So, um, anyways, um, so yeah, I mean, it's a very controversial list for me. I really think that uh, most of these guns are much needed. In a certain amount of damage because there's certain weapons like the shotguns and the, maybe like the uh the dual pistols which is the revolver one i think it's called the tier that one's a big issue right now and i do believe that one needs to be nerfed over any other gun in the game you know i've seen the clips of warzone on twitter and those are the ones that needed to be nerfed not these not all these other weapons you know to begin with we're already tickling the enemy with all these other guns why do we have to tickle it even more like come on man this is not even damage at all so um it's ridiculous man they really need to see the big problem here which is the tier dual pistols which i'll probably post another video for just to share my opinion about them because they are really strong um so anyways, uh, some shotguns got nerfed too, uh, which I have no problem with. To be honest, shotguns are always OP in the first month of release of the games of Call of Duty. So that's not really a shocker, you know, whatever the shotgun, the strongest shotgun in the game is, they always nerf it. So, uh, so yeah, those are my controversial points of some of these weapons. I think some of them don't deserve to be nerfed, uh, especially since we don't make enough damage in the game already. I mean, why would you nerf the most consistent weapons in the game? And I know some of you guys have your own arguments, which is okay. I mean, I ha I'm all ears. To be honest, I'm not here to mute anybody. But, uh, you know, I'm here to listen to anybody out there. Maybe some of these do actually deserve a nerf and I don't know about. So that is it, guys. I want to talk about today, some of these patches. And uh, if you guys want to see some more, leave a like. And I'll see you guys in the next one.